What is good guys and welcome back before we get into the video right here I want to say thank you to EA for allowing me you know what I'm saying to get some early content like this video and also we went to Universal Studios Halloween Horror Nights and now this is most feared so it made sense why we went to the Halloween Horror Nights now I was supposed to vlog you know for you guys and get my reaction because I was scared the whole time I'm telling you I was scared I was running around and I was just I was nervous, man. Like, I was, people were jumping out at me with chainsaws, and I was, like, not having it. We went to, like, the haunted houses, and all the, like, people were popping out the corners. I was not having it. <laughs> um, but I try to vlog, and I'm going to keep it real with y'all. So I try to keep it 100 with y'all. It was nighttime, obviously. It was, like, late at night. We stayed there till like, 2 in the morning. Now, if you guys haven't noticed, your boy's black. You know what I'm saying? My skin obviously now i try to record i thought i had some good footage i looked and because it was dark outside because i'm dark you couldn't see me now i was like how can i color correction no i was too dark and it was too dark how do i do it well i couldn't do it so you got to take my word i was scared my reactions were crazy i was jumping i almost lost my voice i mean i was yelling uh, but it was a lot of fun I'm talking way too much. Let's jump into this right here. And you guys are seeing there are three promos that you have to go through. Now, there's Tomb of the Pharaoh, Wolverine vs. Vampire, and Gronkenstein. Now, I'm going to do Gronkenstein because that just sounds dope. And that was the one that I just wanted to do. Uh, the Pyramid one is basically you going through different, you know, uh, objectives, different uh, game scenarios. And then you go through like a tomb type thing and then you get the Todd Gurley. Now, for the Wolverine vs. Vampire, I don't know what that is. I see Aaron Rodgers. There's also a Denver player. I didn't even touch that one, so I don't know what to do there. And then obviously Gronkenstein is going to be Rob Gronkowski. Um, so I'm very excited about that. I'm going to go through not all of them, some of them, so you guys get to see at least what you're going to have to do to get the Gronk card. Um, you know, the most feared Gronk. So I'm going to show you some of the steps that you're going to have to do um, to get this Gronk card. Obviously, when you click it, you get to this screen right here, Gronkenstein. You guys see there's like a little ticket at the bottom. Now, there's something that's pop called popcorn. Um, popcorn is like stamina. It's like energy points, basically. Basically, unless you have popcorn, you can't enter these uh, events. You need like 100 popcorn, you know, or 150 popcorn per event. Uh, if you enter your 150 popcorn, you get to do the event. And then when you do the event, if you pass it, you know, you get more popcorn or you get, you get, yes, yeah, so you get popcorn plus coins which is very important so you can do the next event as well you stack up on your coins stack up on the popcorn to do the event now they're gonna be easy ones just like that that one was throw a touchdown pass i did a good route mike evans was open wide open in the back of the end zone simple now when you do one um uh, objective you're like oh cool i'm done right i get gronk no no you don't get gronk at all you got to do another one now this one is a jet sweep 150 popcorn again now, I hope you guys love popcorn because you're going to have to have a lot of it. You're going to have to have a lot of popcorn to do this stuff. You guys are seeing Calvin Benjamin getting the ball, and he is running down the field right here. And he's going to score, but it's not about you just scoring. It's about you basically going through all 11 zones and then getting that touchdown at the end. You have four attempts to do it. So maybe you don't have to go through all 11 at once. You can do like three, then you can do like seven. No, you can't do that. It's three, seven, then one or something like that i'm not exactly sure but you do need all 11 right there you finish another one you have to go to another one it's not over one to do one or two i'm telling you i basically did them all and it took me some time there were a lot of easy ones but there were also some ones that were very difficult i'm gonna show you all the ones that i completed you guys are seeing obviously this is sped up don't think that this is how it is going to be i sped it up right here but you guys are seeing hand the ball david johnson to david johnson excuse me and i have to go through the zones i gotta get 11 zones completed and four attempts and you guys saw that i got exactly 11 completed now it's gonna keep going and you're gonna think what am i done you guys are seeing there's four objectives after i completed like two already four more popped up you gotta do these four after these four there's gonna be like four or five more of that pop up again after that, you're going to do another set of like three or four, maybe even five. So there's going to be a lot of things to do. Here, all you have to do is complete four successful passes um, to your receivers. Easy, right? Pick easy routes, do flat routes, do slant routes. It's not asking you to do anything difficult. It's just asking you to complete four passes 
to the primary receiver okay maybe you don't actually get to pick your play maybe it tells you the play but it's not gonna be hard plays i'm not gonna give you hard plays you guys are seeing if i could do it y'all could do it i got big fingers so when i plan of uh you know on the um phone or on a tablet my fingers are kind of big but if i could do it y'all could do it too so make sure you guys do jump in there and try to get this gronkenstein next clear the glass Oh, follow up your blockers and score a touchdown. So this is like the flying V formation entourage, like the gauntlet mode on console. Basically just run, don't get tackled, don't get tackled. There goes David Johnson. We know he's a beast. We know he's fast and he gets into the end zone. We have one chance to do it. I did it on my first chance. There I go. There's 150 more popcorn, 300 more coins stacking up on popcorn. I need extra butter on it as well. Now, back to two more you guys are going to see right here um which two are these i oh navigate through the messy minefield oh you guys probably know this one this is what it looks like you cannot touch the minefield and you cannot get tackled now this one's kind of hard because you guys are going to see look at that i have to run through the minefield and then on top of that you gotta dodge players trying to tackle you and they're pretty fast as well i hit them with a the double spin move uh which gave me the chance to you know what i'm saying get around oh twice oh okay do it twice did it one time mike evans not the fastest guy but he used his speed right there to get around the defender so five chances to do it twice and i did it both on my first two times very good job jumping into another one right here and you guys are going to see knock the knock out the mess and clean the floor ah okay throw it in the zones bad pass by me you have eight attempts to do four zones completed um i'm not exactly sure if you get to pick your own play i don't think you are actually no you don't it just says you know whatever it is yep same route every single time make sure you guys do take your time though find the guy open in the zone he has to be in the zone he can't catch it out the zone then move into the zone he has to catch it in the zone and you guys are seeing right now very good catch by devin Funches. that was nasty right there uh the last zone four out of eight I got four more tries to get one more and wide open in the middle of the field. Jack Doyle is there. The tight end, a very good catch, which means I completed another one. 150 popcorn. Where's the butter? 300 coins. Next, you guys are seeing, I completed all the other ones. Remember there was like four house looking ones? Now there's like these four test tube looking ones. Once you complete that, you're going to have to complete the ones next to Gronk. If you guys didn't see it, like go back like five seconds but you guys saw like there was like blocks next to gronk inside of that like little tube thing you got to complete that as well so you guys got to sit down put on a good tv show and uh you know make sure your phone is charged and then you got to grind it out most feared that one does give you a pack what do i get in this pack i don't know open it i get two things okay do i get no I was going to say, do I get uh, Gronkenstein? No, but I do get Q Andre Diggs, a 73, 73 overall cornerback, and I get a voucher of five lightning. Not sure what the lightning does, but you guys are seeing. Oh, you see, so the locks next to Gronk, there's like four or five of them. You got to do that as well. I'm guessing lightning comes in handy for that because it looks like you're getting shocked or something and you need lightning for that. But you guys are seeing those are locked for now. Level four charge, all that kind of stuff. We're gonna go and do this one, which is complete four or complete three passes. Oh yeah, complete three passes, that's it. And you get to pick your own route. So that means slant routes, comeback routes, do flat routes. I mean, do anything, throw it to your running back, do easy plays, y'all. We just trying to get Gonk, not do the best plays right here. We're trying to get Gronkenstein most feared. All right, come on, Tyrod. One out of uh, three. Here we go. Mike Evans. See that? Easy routes. That's two out of three. Next. Next. All right. Another play. I'm going to go short pass. I'm going to get something easy. And all I have to do is just get a completion. Doesn't even have to be positive yards. Look at that. David Johnson. Got it. Three out of three on three out of three. Very good job. Moving on to the next one. Uh, you guys are going to see. Oh gosh, maze runner. You got to run through the maze, do not go into the white area, and also do not get tackled. And okay, that was easy, but you got to do it twice. Now, this is going to be the last one I'm going to do of the day. 
I just wanted to show you guys, you know, an example, like a gist of what you're gonna have to do. You have to do exactly these things. So you guys saw about seven, maybe seven, between seven and ten different things you're gonna have to do. Um, but I'm also going to be showing you guys a gameplay of all the most feared players. I'm gonna take the most feared players, all of them, put them on my team. Yes, my team, my squad, and then play games online with them uh, against some other YouTubers that I was at the event with. So it's going to be lit. You guys are going to love that. If you guys do want to see that, though, today, smash that thumbs up button. You know what I'm saying? Comment down below. Let me know you want to see it. And I'll drop two videos today. I'll drop this one. Well, you're already watching it, so it's dropped. But you'll see a gameplay with all most feared players on offense and defense. So it's going to be very, very lit. Now, one more time. You are seeing the locks on the right-hand side right there. You see how it's like one two three there's four five locks you're gonna have to do all five of those after you complete all four of those test tubes after you do all four of like the houses or five of the houses however many there were for that and then you're gonna have to do whatever else is before that so it was a lot of things you're gonna have to do um but it's worth it most feared is here halloween time is here i am excited for this now make sure you guys do smash that thumbs up button subscribe to the channel uh if you guys did enjoy and stay tuned i will be dropping you know what I will drop another one for you guys. I will drop that gameplay later, so stay tuned for that. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys later. I am out.